after the sixth, seventh treatment, we really saw it breaking down the blood brain barrier. Mm -hmm. Do I call that a miracle? Yeah. Shannon Doherty calls her latest health update a miracle. And that it's actually breaking that blood brain barrier is a miracle of that drug of and a miracle of, you know, maybe God intervening and being like, I'm going to give her a break, yeah. <laughs> you know? I think I struggle a lot with, with my cancer diagnosis and how fair it is. The actress opening up on her Let's Be Clear podcast amid Shannon's stage four breast cancer diagnosis. You know, sometimes you're looking for miracles yeah. in all the wrong places and they're right there yeah. in front of your face. Shannon also revealed last year the cancer spread to her bones and brain. Yes, I'm a highly spiritual human being. Sure. I believe in God, so I do believe in miracles. And you've sort of run the table in terms of different kinds of breast cancer therapy. You sort of had it all, you know? And I'm so, I'm very grateful that you sitting here in front of me looking as great. Speaking on the pod with her radiation oncologist, the 52 year old now offering a positive update on her ongoing treatment. I'm not gonna say what it, what it is, but I'm on a new, you know, cancer infusion. Yeah. And, you know, after four treatments, we didn't really see a difference and everybody wanted me to switch. And yeah. and I just kind of was like, we're gonna keep going with this sure. and yeah. see. And, you know, yeah, after the sixth, seventh treatment, we really saw it breaking down the blood brain barrier. Mm -hmm. Do I call that a miracle? Yeah. You fortunately have this wonderful platform. You're, you're trying to educate people on kind of what the experience, what your experience has been. You also realize the perspective of the podcast is that you really want you know, this great sort of healthy balance with it of telling your whole life story. But part of that is really the cancer journey. All the while, Shannon's navigated struggles in her personal life, like the divorce filing last year from her now ex-husband, Kurt Iswarienko, which Shannon claims he dropped on her days before she underwent brain surgery. Because it was like a one-two punch. It came like the news about your brain cancer and the divorce came at the same time to fans. Yes. And obviously, seemingly came at the same time for you too. It was like maybe, you know, two or three days apart. So yeah, it was it was pretty brutal. Shannon's positive health update comes after recently telling ET she wants to be a mom. But that all depends on her cancer journey progress. I, you know, have looked at adopting and uh, all sorts of different options. Right now I'm in a, I'm in treatment. I'm gonna just see how that treatment works see what's coming down the pipeline with clinical trials. And if I feel like I can give a long enough time to a child, then I'll definitely do it. Well, if that path is something that you should be taking, then you would crush it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.